G'day mate, welcome back to Factorio Shippy Blocks with me, GD. How's your midweek madness going? Midweek madness? Midweek madness? Yeah, midweek madness. Okay, so today, today we've got a couple of things we, we're going to do. First thing we're going to do is, I need to get rid of this. It's been sitting here for the last five minutes, pissing me off. Uh, the fact that I've got one laser that I forgot all about. Second thing I need to do is I need to comment that I did set up a condition on this pump that if the tank had enough oil in it and blah, 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 the, this ship would get the hell out of the way. Mm, the other ship would get the hell out of the way. The other ship would get the hell out of the way. One of the ships will get the hell out of the way. I did set that up. Okay, next thing I need to do is... Uh, nope, not these guys. Uh... These guys piss me off. This worm. It's pissing me off. It keeps hitting the roboports. It keeps shooting lasers. So we're going to find uh you. I'm pretty sure you're full of lasers. Uh we're gonna send you off to strafe here. With no weight condition. It's either gonna work really well or really not well. Uh either way, it's gonna be entertaining to see. Today's episode, we need to do red circuits. Red circuits is gonna be the plan. Now, uh, I have this build here, this build here that should work. It probably does, uh, but I'm not happy with it. So we're going to unmerge those chests. We're going to delete that. We are definitely going to delete all of that and most of that with some of that, with a touch of that. Uh, okay, so this is my red circuit build. It's a very good build. I'm very proud of this build, but we sort of jerry-rigged it together, as I'm known for. So I want to tidy it up. Uh, and hopefully tidy it up in a way that it'll keep working. Uh, where's that boat? There's dead things. I think that one's got lasers. That could be a problem. Hey, you. Hey, you. Hey, you. You, you. Psst, you. There we go. Come back here. Now. Yeah. I didn't expect that problem to happen. Of all the problems I expected, that was not on the list. Quick, bots, bring over another radar. Hey! Even a horn of happiness. Okay, so, uh, we needed to set up this build. So, we're going to have copper come down here. We're going to have copper come down. Uh... Here, yes. Uh, we're gonna have copper come down. Uh -huh. Cut. Uh, that tongue, that tongue. So uh, these two are gonna share one single copper belt, and then copper should come down there. And I'm pretty sure that'll use a whole red belt of copper. Uh, let's just double check. Uh, you're going to use 15 copper, that'll be f 15 doubled, 30, 30, 30. You will use a whole red belt's worth of copper. Okay, so that should fix any previous JD mistakes. Uh, it sounds like there's a traffic jam. There is a traffic jam. There's too much iron ore and not nearly enough unload because we're not using this nearly as much as we used to. It's fine. We also have a small robot army hoping to fix our problems. Okay. And boats everywhere. Boats everywhere. All right. I need to remove all of that. I also need to fix this problem. Now, red circuits are a two to two to two. We need two plastic bars, plus we need two bits of copper, plus we need two electronic circuits. Uh, now, they stack in 200s, they stack in 100s, they stack in 100s. So technically it means... If I have six of those, I need 12 of these guys. And I need 12 of these guys, in theory. Uh, sure. Sure, it definitely sounds like the boats are not happy with me. It's almost like I caused a traffic jam by going and strafing a biter base. Okay, uh, we need that, and we need that, and we need that. That should fix all those problems. Uh, we don't need any of that to direct insert. Okay. So, after the bots have ripped up and removed everything and replaced it all, we should, should be able to get red circuits placed back down. Now, one thing I think I want to do is, now we know where these guys sit. Uh, actually, no. I want to... 
Oh, well, that's gonna be wrong now. Ah, uh, that's gonna be wrong. Uh, I want to make sure the outputs work a lot better because the way the outputs were, they sucked. Uh, can I get? Okay, we're gonna leave that there. Uh, okay, I need this done. Come on, bots. I don't know what's what. Uh, that's the input. That's the input. That's an output. That's an output. Okay. Uh, can I get a splitter? Okay, so plastic goes into. No, green circuits go in there. And plastic goes in there. Mmm, yes. Can I make this look any neater? Do I care if it looks any neater? That's probably a better question. Um. Yeah, I honestly don't care. Alright, okay, I think I'm happy with that. We're going to cut the whole thing. Uh, no, we're going to try that again. We're going to cut the whole thing, rubber ports included, and I'm going to slide it far to the left. Uh, I want it eh, there. Mm, try again. Hang on. Uh, it's crap down there too. All right, uh, we're gonna put that whole build there. Okay, so that should should work. Should uh, probably work slightly better if you guys have power. Cool. Oh, now I just need the ten thousand robots to come back with gear and put everything back down. All right, so robots. Uh, we have some spare robot ports that we have dropped down previously for projects such as this. Uh, uh, actually, let's put you guys on that side. That way you're less likely to be in my way in about five seconds time. Uh, same with this one. Can I remove that and remove that? Really? I'm all out? Okay. Uh, I'd also really like this guy down. Okay. Please, other robots, please deliver me some robot ports. Thank you. Uh, we're going to say 20. And hopefully storage full. Uh, the only storage full is that guy's storage right there. The poor sucker is, is hovering there with one piece of wood and nowhere to put things. It's fine. We'll deal with him shortly. Uh, we should probably power up across the top. I should power? No. We actually have power. Uh, let's move that up out of the way. Yeah. Okay. Do we have power over here now? No. Who broke what? Don't say JD did it. You're lying. It's slander. It's shitty power poles and they're shitty connections. Okay. All right. So that looks like it's working. Have I? No, I still haven't found rubber ports in my inventory magically. Uh, you, can I have those things that you're not meant to be carrying around? Oh. Uh. Oh. Alright, so we just need the robots to pick everything up, put it all back down. After they've picked up everything and put it all back down, we should be happy. Uh, you don't do power poles, believe it or not. No. Okay, can we get a new upgrade planner, please? I want to do shitty power poles to less shitty power poles. And I want to strafe that whole build. Cool. And we can then delete that. So if that gets done, we should be okay that we can duplicate the build a couple of times. I just need everything to be cleaned up. Uh, can I get a power pole there and a power pole there? Cool, you'll now get powered if you get a little bit of power. Things might actually happen. No, I still... Really? Where are you, Logibots? Storage is not that far away. I can mass dismantle all I want, bots. You should listen to me. No? Okay, fine. We'll wait around semi-patiently. Alright, whilst we wait around semi-patiently, can I have a output? Uh, we're going to put first output here. Uh, no, I want... I don't know how many red circuit builds we're going to do. Let's assume that's one. 
let's assume let's just assume that all that's in my way uh, let's assume that that's a second uh, no you need a four tile gap that's the second that's the third so it looks like we're gonna have three lots of red circuits on this island roughly uh, we'll remove all that a second time because I don't actually want it down yet so I need uh, one two three okay we can start running some belts. So, uh, belt comes out of you, out of you, and out of you, and thank you. Okay, we're going to run this up, you horrible power poles, and through the whole forest, radar in your overtile, and... You go in there. You are going to have to come through there. And you are going to have to go through there. Okay. So now we've got two belts. We're going to keep carrying two belts forward. Until uh, we get to here. How much this has been built. Uh, parts of it. Some of it. A little bit of it. Okay. Same time we want to have... Uh, three coming out of here and three coming out of here. We Powerpole? Powerpole. Okay, so we're going to have you... And then go down and down and down. Plug that in there, plug that in there. Uh, down, down, down. I think I really want a tile in the middle. Like a one tile gap. Just, just to make rounding these easier. But I have never been a fan of making my life easier. So, we'll continue you guys straight through, we'll copy you guys, and we'll just run that straight down. Here is when things are getting tricky, you go through, you go through, you go through, you go through, and everybody else gets dragged over the top. And these shouldn't matter, but it should be that belt and... That belt? Sure. And you can go away. You're going to bring that one along. And that one along. Okay, so. Why for you not powered? Mm, we're just missing odd power poles? We're missing odd power poles still. Uh, yeah, according to this, we are missing one power pole in the network. Okay. So with that done, I should, in theory, be able to copy from here to here. Yup. And then all I need to do is put a RoboPort there. That's straight. And a RoboPort here. And probably remove all that shit just on the off chance. And then drop the whole blueprint down. And in theory, with magic, it should just work. Okay, looks good up here. Uh, we'll plug that in there. We'll bring that in like so. And in theory, once again, I should be able to copy the whole thing because the robot's not working hard enough. And put the next blueprint there with a final set of robot ports. Uh, straight line, straight line, straight line. There. Mm. Easier isn't entertaining. Thanks. Thanks. Well, I do try not to make my life easy. Uh, that's why we started a normal world and end up with biters everywhere on episode two. Okay, so that should get first one up and running for copper. That should get the second one up and running for copper. Uh, power should drag across between the first and second. We may be missing some assemblers and some inserters and probably some power poles. We need to take all four... Whoop. For you guys forward. Uh, red circuits out. Technically go into here. Okay, so let's remove that. Uh, hmm. Okay, we're going to come up with a better solution to this. Um...
for the moment, let's just delete everything. Let's put a splitter here. And that'll be belt number one. Okay, belt number two is that belt. Come to there and up to there. Uh, which you'll need an underground. It's like building a bus. Should be fine. Okay, I've never failed at building a bus before. All right, so where are we up to? Uh, your belt number three. Your belt number four, which also means my red circuits need to patch in here, which probably means uh, that I regret everything. Okay, so we're going to patch that through to there, that through to there. We're going to put some red circuits to the network. Uh, I want you to come down a tile. And then we're going to run that to there and merge those two together. No. Because then I'm going to end up with the exact same problem I just fixed. Um... We're going to run that through to there, that through to there, that through to there, and then merge them together again. Okay. Uh, so that's the first split off. That's... What? What? Go forward. Bad belt. Okay. That's the second split off, which is going to go there, which is not going to happen, so I need to underground... That to that. See, I fixed it with ghost belts. You didn't even get a chance to call me out, chat, on me being wrong. Okay, I need to delete all of that and replace it with all of that. That should magically plug together. Okay, red circuits go in here, out here, and into that belt, which we are going to upgrade all the way through. You still don't have any power. Oh, you're really having a bad day. Um, let's remove you... Let's run that. That into there. And into there. And scrub that over that. Okay. So, that should fix that problem. All we need to do is work out what spaghetti we made down here and plug it all together. So, all of that is wrong. Uh, your belt one, your belt two. We need a splitter there. And you're going to go north. Uh, we need a splitter there. You're going to go north. You are going to jump over and under. You're going to go there. And you're going to go there. Now, if I've plugged everything together right, it should just work. It's like Nike. It just works, right? Oh, no. That was NVIDIA. If you could ever buy one. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, it looks like the build's working at least. Uh, would help more if I had some belts. Uh, so what are we missing? We're missing 300 belts. That's it. Actually, that I'm sort of impressed. Okay, it also means I don't need you guys anymore, and I probably don't need you guys anymore. Uh, buy Army of Robots. Okay. So we just need to get the final pieces in and done, and then we should be good to go, which means I'm finished with Red Circuit Island. Red Circuit Island was an easy one. Uh, in theory, this ship is going to green circuit export, red circuit import, copper export, which is the big copper. Uh, actually, let's just click on that. Go there. That is the big copper export. That is the green circuit export original. Um, do we want to change over this one? And then you're still going to old plastic. Old plastic is, needs to be replaced. That's going to be the next station we're going to be replacing. I don't know where I'm going to put it, but it's going to be a station I'm going to want to replace. Um, is new green circuit working? Or old green circuit working? Uh, 200,000. I'd say old green circuit is working perfectly fine now at this point. Technically, it needs all the belts upgraded to blue belt. Later, JD problem still. Okay. Can we get this outputting, please? I just need to see stuff come out. I need to have it actually... Really... Stand inside the network, JD. There's four on the way, 11 on the way. Okay, so we have it literally none in storage. Yeah, it says we're 150 short. Okay. Where was the beeping? How rude. 
Okay. In theory it works. I see red circuits. That looks like a pretty straight belt. It's just going to plug into there. Once it plugs into there, things magically should happen. All right. So, red circuits are done. I think the train... Oh, no. We want to update the train orders. Damn. Okay. I need to make a start, smart station. So, GDA has to do smarts. This is going to be horrible. Okay. So, what we want to do is... Make sure I have combinators. Combinators, combinators, combinators. Uh... And constant. Okay. Shit. Alright, I want constant. Give me back. First off. Substation. Go away. Here. And. Here. Alright. We want a constant combinator. And I'm going to build this at the top and hope that I build everything correctly. Okay, constant combinator is going to have a negative signal. I need to know how much I want in each of these. So you hold, uh, let's go with 35k. Uh, copper. Minus 35,000. And we all know it's a two, it's a one to one to one. So we want green circuits. We want minus 35,000. The new moon loaders out of the ship to allow a buffer in the chest? Probably. Uh, we also need, what was the third item? Plastic. Minus 35,000. Okay. Uh, actually, we've got the room now. So we're going to do that. Ooh, we're going to do that. I'm going to cut you and put you on that side. We're going to do that. And I regret my decisions here. Uh, do I have chests? I do. Unload. Reload. Okay. And we're going to duplicate those guys as well. Okay. So, minus 35,000 of each. Exactly what I said. Minus 35,000 each. Okay. Uh, from there, I want to go... Uh, arithmetic -y 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 -y. Combinator. Uh, okay. We're going to use green wire because it's, in theory, the easier one for me to see. Uh, we want to plug that in there. I want to set that to... Uh, uh, everything, each, everything, each, 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 multiplied by minus one, uh, output is each. Okay, so we turn everything into a positive figure. Excellent. All right. Uh, and then I want, uh, good question. I wrote, I wrote this down. I wrote this down. Uh, I want storage. Yes. Okay. So I want storage. I want storage from this chest to this chest to this chest to this chest with that. And then I want each times by negative one again. Output each. So I have a giant negative number, which we've then converted into a positive number, which then pops out here as minus. Why do you have minus? No, I did that wrong. I did that very wrong. Uh, there. Is that right? Input signals minus... No. See, this is why Jetty sucks at combinators. Oh, hang on. Do you need to be different colors? I think I need some different colors. So I don't contaminate signals. Mm, nah. What have I done wrong? Uh... Oh, that's what I did. Okay. I worked it out now. I worked it out now. I did a silly mistake. Okay, I want... That. Except I want them to be red. Uh, I want that. Uh, except I want them to be red. And I want that. Uh, you guys are going to have to move over to all. Except I want them to be red. Okay. Now we get to unmerge all the chests. 
The game didn't crash, but that is a lot of wires now. Holy wire. Uh, cool. One wire in here. Okay, so now we're going to read the contents of Magic Chest. Alright, we're getting there. Uh, so that's negative. Negative comes in there, comes out as a positive. Positive then comes out as a negative. Great. Alright, so we've got a very, very large negative number. Alright, and then I want... Uh, that should tell me what I need to add to storage, but it's not. What I do wrong... Hmm. He meant to be a one. Hmm. 35, 35. No, I've boo-booed somewhere. <sighs> I have that plugged into... I'm going to go off my original notes. Multiply by minus one. Okay. And then I want all those copper circuits to go away. And then I want to join that signal into there, which we're going to do read train contents. And we're going to bring down here. And we're going to set you to filters. Set filters. Mm, no, because I have a negative signal. <laughs> oh, I boo boo. The very first step. The very first step. Uh, you're now putting plastic. Yeah, the very first step. I'm double negativing it. Okay, uh, that one, that one, that one. So what, 35 of each goes into the first combinator. Now it comes out as a negative number. Negative number comes in here. It's now saying what I actually want in storage. And then I want to have wire, 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 more wires. Lots of... missed one. Wires, 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 and wires. And I want that to be set all the way down. So it's saying that because I want 35,000 of each, I actually have too much green circuits in here, but not enough of the other materials. So we're going to unload the other materials. The other important thing I can do is have a filter inside a place and a purple chest. I have purple chests. Okay. I want a filter inserter here and I want, I think it's, there's a certain wire this guy's going to plug into. You need to plug into the constant combinator. Uh, no. Yes. And if I set you to set filters, what happens? Okay. And then I want you to set filters blacklist. That's what I want. Okay. So, smart station. Smart station. Jenny is doing smarts. Jenny is doing smarts. He had to re remember how he did his own smarts because I did this like two weeks ago now and I'm just getting a chance to implement it now so we have a very very large positive number this is what I actually want in storage I can then adjust these as I see fit also means my boat I can set whatever numbers I want here actually yeah I can set whatever numbers I want here and you know the boat will just unload okay so we have uh what I want in storage so 35,000 copper 35,000 electronic circuits 35,000 plastic we're then converting that to a negative number the reason I want to convert that to a negative number is I want a positive number here that I can feed into this lovely little combinator uh and I can blacklist so if the boat for whatever reason unloads sulfur or something else stupid because we're going to have contaminated boats it means that this little guy will get rid of it and just dump it down, okay? Because it's going to pick up anything like that that isn't one of these, these three items in the filter list. Okay, we then take our very large number, we turn it into a negative, we add it to what's already in storage, which then gives us a positive number. We take the positive number, which we're gonna read the train contents, and I don't send it to the train, do I? Nah, we're gonna add to the train's contents which means technically there's going to be a situation where I'm probably going to end up having a lot of stuff unloaded, like a lot of potentially over-the-top unnecessary stuff unloaded, but that's all the point. I should end up with a very, very large positive amount of materials in here, which means ship should 
unload much faster. Uh, do the output loaders need to be red filtered ones? They need to be filtered. They need to be filtered so things stay on the right belt. Alright. Uh, does the chest store enough? Should do. Uh, 30,000 is... Yeah, we, it should do. It should do. I'm pretty sure with 35,000 we should be fine. Where is my boat? I need you here so we can test this. Hurry up. You do have blue lotus. Hurry up. Hurry up nonetheless. Uh, you probably need to be rearranged so you have many, many more loaders in. Because, uh, how much are you loading? 18,000. That's going to take a second. Uh, can I get rid of you? And can I get rid of you? Can I put a substation like here and here? And can I just take a few of those and just jam them there and, you know, put in some steel chests like so. You don't have power. That sucks. Well, I made it worse. And I just dumped like 9,000 green circuits in the network. It's fine. It's fine. We'll find a use for them eventually. Oh, the poor robots. 12,000. Come on. You're a perfect example, actually, because you have a wild battery in there. And I want to see, in theory, we should have a wild battery get unloaded. And they should get shoved out the active provider. And into the network. Which means I need to have very, very good recycling around this base. Because bad things are going to happen. And bad things are going to happen fairly often. Come on. What are we up to? We're up to 15,000. Uh, but all your inputs are filtered. Unless you delete a wire, you don't need the active chest. Um, except it is retrain contents. If the train happens to have a battery in it, it will end up passing through here. So I do need to get rid of excess. Otherwise, we're going to end up with weird odd items in ones and twosies that will end up clogging up the system eventually. Like, it might take a thousand, a thousand days, a thousand years, and, you know, the, the blackening of the sun, but it would happen eventually. And I know my luck, it would happen far too soon. Far, far, far too soon. Okay, so boat is arriving. Boat is coming. Boat has one stupid battery in there. We should see the one stupid battery leave the boat and pop into here, and then get spat out there. We should. We should. Uh, you could just quick replace it with a steel chest. Oh. Why well, I need to read the ship contents? The idea being is it should, rather than me having a, this set limit, it should be this set limit plus up to 50% of what's on the cargo of the ship. And as we can see, that filter is definitely set to a battery, so eventually... When a battery ends up at the top of the pile, where the hell is the battery? Where is the battery? Why is this wider than what I can see? Haha, -ha, there's my battery. So in theory, the battery would eventually end up in here. And the reason is, I, is you are designed to have 18, 18, and 18. So what I actually get loaded in here is 35 plus 50% of what's in, in here being 18 total. Uh, well, that's unfortunate. You're unloading all that stuff and you're not putting copper in. Um, I didn't account for that. I didn't account for that at all. Hum. Maybe I need to have more storage. Oh, there we go. There's copper running again. Is it going to cause a problem? Technically, yes. Maybe. Okay. So we have two more slots up there. If I move you higher... And you won't fit. If I move you to there... Hello, my friend. Stay a while uh, and listen. The Golden Wolf. Thank you for clicking the, click the subscribe button. Thank you for liking the video. Will you reach? No. Oh, well, you would if the inserter actually existed. And my inserter back, please. Thank you. Uh, I want to go... Where's my wire? My wire from there to there. Mm. And instantly you black out. Did I hook you into the wrong spot? I think I did. I definitely did. Where is wire? It's a red wire. Uh, there to there. 
I want to go from a green wire from there to there. Cool. Better. All right. So all I need to do is remove you, remove you. Uh, we're going to add a couple more like that. We're going to copy those up. I don't have them on me. Damn. Uh, okay. We're, no, we're going to copy those up and I will put down red ones and we shall upgrade plan of them and I will hook red wire into you you and you you there we go okay and then all I need to do is unmerge and remerge okay solved all right so that should fix all my problems right I hope so Ship's not getting out of the damn way. Whole different situation. All right, so red circuits are fixed. Red circuits are glorious. We should have lots of red circuits in here. Also, ship is empty. We just need it moving around faster. Okay. Next job. Next job is plastic. Hmm. Uh, it's not a storage problem, but a priority problem during unloading. Well, technically, I need them all unloaded at the same rate because it's one to one to one ratio. But there's nothing stopping me. Like, you're going to actual copper. Oh, actually, that's the other thing. It should simplify the orders out. You are going to be... Uh, one second in activity. And... Time passed. Ten. That should be long enough that it can get fuel and just unload everything. Unload everything. Away we go. Uh, okay, so I need to go and do plastic which i'm thinking about doing on this island this island seems like a pretty good spot to do plastic hopefully it's far enough away from everything else that we can get exports from here into here without too much hassle as for this problem how many damn boats do you have come into here you're just doing iron you know what? i'm done with you you can go to iron import empty all right that's one less boat uh, you're a mixed. You're doing just coal. That looks pretty full, sir. Pretty damn full. Uh, two seconds. No, we're burning it off. Uh, one second. Come on, you can do it. One second, one second. Hey! Okay. You're also going to smeltery. Okay, you are no longer going to smeltery. You are going to, uh, iron import and empty. Goodbye. All right, hopefully less of a traffic jam. Oh, mean whilst. Do we actually have red circuits for a change? We do. Do I want to increase storage? You betcha I do. Let's do that whilst we can actually reach it. Why for you having problems? Oh, some idiot took your inserter. Meh. You have one output, two input. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Okay, hang on. Did I duplicate that problem? No. Oh, yes. I did duplicate that problem. That's the best way to do it, JD. Make sure you make a problem and then do it five times. Uh, you can just go there. And you can also go there. Okay. All right. Uh, this storage. Remove, 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 remove. Uh, substation here and here. And I want... Uh, it seems like a bad amount enough. Uh, merch. Okay. Unmerch. Remerch. Unmerch. Unmerch. That many chests. No, too many. Okay. That many chests. Alright. Uh, in you go. Uh, side note, how many red circuits exactly are we making? We are making 45 a second. Okay. I guess I can upgrade the belts. Alright. Uh, actually, I want to make you potentially longer as well. Done. I think. No.
You, for the longest time, have pissed me off. The fact that you are the only one who seems to have to dump their, their circuits on the floor like grubs. Uh, let's move you back a tile. Okay, now I'm done. All right, uh, off to do oil. Mm. So if you set two copper, two plastic, two green circuits, they at least check out the resources. When you use it to zero, you can set the filter to nothing. Yeah, that's, that's, I, I don't understand. Oh, good. I found more. Well, there goes some more yellow ammo. Okay, so up here, we need to do a plastic island. So plastic island is going to feature coal coming in. It's going to fe feature light oil coming in. Uh, light oil, uh, petroleum coming in. And that's pretty much it. It should be a fairly simple island with a whole lot of spaghetti. Okay. Oh, wrong island. Never mind. Okay, first things first. Second one of those. Second thing I want to do is just delete everything. Third thing I want to do is basically copy... As bad as it is... That. Because it sort of works. Okay, you guys need to go. Uh, curved waterways in the way. Well, just paste over the top. Did you... You did rename them. Okay, so I want you to be... Uh... Petroleum import, and then I want you to be uh, coal import. Doo, doo, doo. Okay, sure. Uh, you are gonna be coal, nothing but coal. You can all go away. Uh, Turns out I can't unmerge ghosts. All right. So from here, we just need chem plants. We need chem plants. We need a lot of chem plants. Do a lot of plastic. I want basically a build that looks like that. <sighs> Except then we need to make sure it's going to run as fast as possible with obviously input for... Oh. So let's assume we're going to import that way. Uh, with one of them. I don't think I'm going to be able to cover an island with these guys, because I have a feeling um, we're just not going to get the throughput that we'd need to do something like that. I have a feeling I'm not going to need that many of these guys to... I'm only going to need a handful. I have a feeling. I have a feeling. All right. Uh, where were we? We will want to look at old oil whilst we wait for these guys to show up. You are consuming uh, a yellow belt. How are we one short? 14 of them. Okay. We're consuming a yellow belt for a red belt. Uh, and what I want to do is a red belt in, therefore two red belts out. Obviously they work better with beacons, but if that's going to be the case, we should be able to do that be belt number one. That be belt number two. Uh, that looks like it failed miserably. Let's put the power on this side. Okay. Try again. Oh, the old build has extra inserters all through it. Excellent. I love spare inserters that do nothing. Uh, there to there to there to there to... There? Okay. That looks like it should do... Yellow belt in, red belt out. Okay, first red belt goes over there. Second red belt goes over here. It also means this one is probably screwed with lots of double inserters. Yes. Uh, so you... Oop. Okay. You two, you two, you two, you one. You two, you two, you two, one. Okay, cool. Uh, you're not hooked up. No, that did not tile well. Okay, try again, JD. Alright, I want that to go to there. 
and then in theory there and there and there and there I guess uh, flip it and whack it there okay and how do I get power to the outside I guess from the outside okay uh you, you, no, you are set to petroleum. Uh, I do have a tanker. Let's get a tanker up and running. Let's set uh, you with some fuel. We want you to go to oil export two, right? Yes. Oil export two. I want you to pick up a fluid cow. Fluid cow full let's go with full and then i want you to come to there and say empty uh you are boat 386 which means i need that one really i had spares for exactly this reason mm, use substations 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 I'm trying my best to use substations. Also, a decider. It's a arithmetic. It is a decider. I thought you just craft, crafted one of those. Okay. You are zero. Okay. So, I want to change you to 386. Train equals 386, right? Uh, 368. It's close enough. Uh, 368. You uh, can be pasted onto that one. At the same time, I'm going to do something important like mark that with a power pole. At least then hopefully I realize that I've already used the top one. And then go. So you should go to there, go to there. Just bring me lots and lots and lots of... Um, Lots of lots of stuff and things. Okay, uh, lots of petroleum. Next one is we're going to need a normal boat. Normal boat's going to come here. We're going to throw some fuel in there. You, I want to set to... I've got a coal one export? How's coal one export? Where is that? Okay, does it already have a boat? It has this boat, it turns out. Excellent. Past jetty, plan to head for future jetty. Okay. We want you to go there. We're going to go with full. We're going to go with empty. We're not going to do anything more complicated than that. Goodbye. You're done. Okay. So, fluid in here. Coal in here. Great. All right. Next thing I need to do is I need to work out how to get fluid into these, which is going to be there. Uh, oh, there and there with a connecting pipe. I think if I move you down... Uh, actually, does that help? Not really. Uh, the build's not that big. If I... Okay. I want to work out where we're going to put these. Okay, so let's put one in line with that. One close. Uh, there. Can I fit a second one? Uh, technically, sort of. Not really. Okay, you go away. Can I fit one here? Second one here. All right. We're gonna hook that up. That'll be a passive passive pipe. Uh, we want you to output. So I want a pump. Uh, which you'll need an underground to here somewhere. Uh, let's go to pump, pump there. Uh, straight bit of pipe. Which means that could go here. I'm gonna run this around. Sure. That sort of ruined my fun. 
Mm, Lady Jenny problem. Space for Bacons? Space for Bacon is totally a Lady Jenny problem. Uh... In theory, we make it good enough, it'll never need bacons, because we'll just have so much plastic that we'll never need to bacon our plastic. Sure, that sort of works. Uh, okay, let's work on the ends. So, they don't need to be there, and they don't need to be there, and you don't need to be there. We're going to run you that way, you that way, without that. That way. Uh... We're going to copy that, we're going to throw that there, we're going to run that one that way, and that one that way. So that gives us four. If I can get two more in, I'm going to be really, really happy. The issue is probably going to be the piping. Uh, okay, so which is the pump that works? Why do you not have oil? We drained it. Shit, we've drained it. Yeah, that's a bit of a loading problem. Well, that's a desperate loading problem. We're only pumping in 600 per second. Ooh. Yeah, it's taking too long to squeeze its way through the par or through the tanks. Damn! All right, future jetty problem, 100%. Okay, uh, where were we? we want a substation about here, and what about there? Okay, so, mm, shit. Past jetty suck. We're gonna power things up from the outside. Uh, okay. Can I get one of them, please? Yeah. And put one of them in there. And... Resolved. <sighs> I already know I'm out of time. And... Uh, why don't you run any builds left or right for throughput without tons of turns? Because Factorio... I don't know. No legitimate reason. Wait till, wait till next stream, and then I'll see whether I can think of a legitimate reason. I don't think I will, but you never know. It might happen. Okay. Uh, past Jetty, you suck. You go to there, you go to there, you go to there, you go to there, and you go to there. All right. Uh, we're putting in underground, underground belts for throughput. It's less items moving on a belt, and therefore it's less frames, and therefore it makes things go faster. Um... Okay, sure. Let's try... Let's try putting some left to right. Oh, up to down. Uh, left to right. Okay. Uh... I missed which ones were active. Whatever, actually. You're unloading still? No, you've already either unloaded or... You've already unloaded and you're back over there filling back up. Awesome. Okay. All right. Uh, screw it. We're just going to put off that one. We'll have a pump. And off. Shit. Um, I want to get pumped right here. Cool. Because we like squiggles. Uh... Okay. You can go there with that going that direction. And you can go there with that going that direction. Is it any better building it left to right than up to down? It does mean that the belts are not going up to then come back down. Does it give any other distinct advantage? No, not really. Did I paste down the build that did not have substations twice? Yes. Do I feel bad about it? You betcha. Am I going to fix it? Mm, probably. All right. Let's assume that I've magically fixed everything. Um, 
Was you a tipping bomb video? Were you? Were you? Do you know tipping bomb just had a had an update? Well, they're they're they're, they're talking about an update. Talking about an update where we're going to have golems. We're going to have, I believe, dead beavers. At least that's the way I'm interpreting uh, Dead beavers. Uh, which, you know, makes it a little bit harder for me to make jokes. But I'm pretty sure I'll find a way. Um, I want an export station. Where is... You'll do. We just made one of you. Oh. Uh, I need to ungroup that. And regroup that. Okay. I want an export station. We're going to go from about there to about there. We want to go... Sure, looks good to me. Uh, I want fuel, which is that guy. We want that there. We want one of them there. Uh, yeah, Team of Born has an update coming. Uh, it is a bunch of robot beavers that are meant to be there for late game. The problem is, as I found with every playthrough so far, uh, I run out of PC before I run out of Beaver. Uh, so, we'll see how it goes. Um, it's definitely a game I enjoyed playing, but playing the game at half speed and having to cut out a lot of stuff uh, takes time, and it's a little bit frustrating. And I turned off my legs. Uh, Alt-E, there we go. Okay, so, uh, we are going to fix you, and we're going to fix you by copying one of them and putting that there and that there. Okay, so providing I've done this correct, we should, no, nope, we should have that going that way and that going that way and copy that and straight into there. How is it that I line things up every time without trying? That's the really important question you guys should be asking. It's like I've played too much for Factory and I'm professional at this point. Uh, okay, so we're going to bring that belt to there, we're going to bring that belt to there, we're going to bring that belt to the bad belt, that belt to there, we're going to remove those four that don't need to be there, those four that don't need to be there, and those four that don't need to be there. Eventually we'll have petroleum show up, eventually we will have coal show up, eventually in theory it will work. You're almost full, and you're almost full as well. Why is that import turned off? Oh no, it already has petroleum, never mind, go petroleum, go. Uh... You just need power, because the substations don't exist, okay? And you guys just need plastic. Plastic, uh, the other plastic, the gold plastic, the the black plastic. Okay, we're gonna bring that ship, oh my god, that's the other end of the map. Okay. <sighs> uh, replacement beavers. Uh, there should be mod factory to bot in the beavers, or maybe beaver butters. That means we'd have to burn all the fur off with flame torrents. I can smell it. Professional at making Lady Jetty problems. Correct, Bavoli. 100% professional at making Lady Jetty problems. I am very good at making Lady Jetty, Jetty problems. And you know what? The most important thing is, the only person that complains is Jetty. And nobody cares what he has to say. Alright, so you are in theory picking up plastic 18,000 at a time. You have plastic, which sort of implies that either this works really well or it's broken entirely. Uh, you... We're out of copper. Okay, so you have 18, 18, and 11. And... You are set to... Maybe one second is not enough. Maybe two seconds is better. Uh, okay, so you are using how many slots? You're using about half the boat. So I should be able to set this up to 18 uh, plus 9 would be 27. So let's go with 25 for good luck. I'll set you to 25. And we'll set you to 25. And that's 25 slots plus 25 slots plus uh, 12 slots out of... Sorry. 250 slots plus 250 slots plus a uh, half that amount for the plastic that should uh, for the green circuits that should be fine uh, but it's only at there there we go that was the issue all right so plastic plastic lots of plastic lots of plastic 
Lots of plastic. We completed the, uh, the the job for today. We have lots of plastic, like a lot of plastic. Like a lot, a lot of plastic. A lot of plastic. A lot of plastic should fix a lot of problems. Uh, at the same time, they should be almost a full belt's worth. Not quite a full belt's. But I could start putting modules in these. And should we make them left to right rather than top to bottom? Probably. Probably. It sort of makes sense. I guess I'm just setting my ways of going up and down. Alright, so we have a lot of plastic, which means boats like that one, wherever the hell it went, uh, you, you could now get plastic from here and have no issue picking up 25,000. In fact, uh, where's red circuit? So you go red circuit, then you go green circuit. So if you picked up plastic first, we want to do plastic export uh, all the way up there. We will want you to pick up item count. Uh, plastic uh, greater than or equal to 25,000 uh, or time passed or inactivity. We're going to go with 180 because in theory you should fill up faster than that. And in theory, go. In theory, it means you can now get lots of plastic. Also means, and this is one of the reasons I want to set up a smart unload station, and we're going to be using a lot of these in the future, is even though that I thoroughly boo-booed the loading and unloading for this, in theory, even though it's it's like it, it, no plastics in here, it's all green circuits, it's all copper, in theory, this system should auto-balance it back out. We'll have to check at the end of next episode to see if this is balanced back out. Oh, also that stupid battery is going to get kicked out again. Which means, like I said, I've got to work on some really good uh, recycling for all the shit that's going to end up in storage. With these mods, you've beaten the game so bad now. I've beaten the game 15 different ways from Sunday. But it's fine. It's fine. That's half the fun. I enjoy the game and I just keep making the game different and more interesting. Speaking of different and more interesting, we have uh, a special episode, special double episode tonight of uh captive industry captive industry video comes out in about two hours also this weekend on saturday night over on twitch again i should be bidding factoria in a different way uh we should have a modded playthrough with a giant australian spider that we have to kill um yeah yeah uh dylan you dylan death you slowly play oh, sorry you're late with the playthrough don't know what the goal is the goal was to get red circuits uh back up and running with a smart unloading station which looks like it's working apart from somebody forgot to connect some belts. With that done, we should have three th three lots of red circuits pumping out at full speed, giving us a blue belt worth of red circuits, which should fix that problem finally. Also, because we now have a smart station, it should self-load and self-level. We shouldn't have any more problems. We also set up, right where I'm standing, we set up a mega plastic build, which is going to have that problem. It's going to have that problem. Uh, that problem of, I need to upgrade those guys, and I probably don't want to set you to empty. I probably want to set to, uh, send to train, uh, what did I set for that boat? That boat, that boat, that boat. I set you to... Battery import? Uh, that one. No. Oh, I thought I set up a signal. Send train. I did. Yeah, if crude oil is less than 5k. Okay, so what I need to do is the basic exact, exact same here. I need to set up uh, you... Signal, 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 signal. Uh, second condition, if, uh, crude oil, petroleum, yeah, that's the one, is less than 5,000. If it's less than 5,000, piss off, get out of the way, so the next boat can come in. Uh, also, at the same time, we might just, because I'm a fan of having, you know, bigger buffers at this stage, out of my way. Uh, undo that, and redo that. Okay, that should fix that problem you are okay so they are both loading that's right and then we've got this silly pipe here to connect everything together because i couldn't get things to work properly with vanilla awesome all right so we can so we can play tonight's goal um yes so 
Captain Industry special video comes out two hours. Also, as said, uh, this weekend, Saturday night over at Twitch, we should be doing a special event um, chasing down an Australian spider. It's a very, very pissed off spider trump. That's all the hints I'm going to give you right at the moment. Uh, that should be starting this Saturday at 9 p.m. 9 p.m. Uh, Sydney time. Yeah, 9 p.m. Sydney time. But with all that said, I need to end this stream here. I'm over time, as always. That has become the norm. Next episode. Now we have plastic up and running. We probably need to do something about rocket fuel. Uh, just so I can get it off this island. I think that's the last thing we have here. Lube's done. Acid's done. Sulfur's done. Batteries are done. Uh, wrong island. Uh, solid fuel, but nobody's using that anymore. So, if we can get... Asses, yeah, we, we literally just need to get light oil put over here, turn around a bunch of rocket fuel. After we've done that, we can decommission this one, move all the boats over to the new island. Also means, and this is going to be an important one, we can come to Boom Island, Boom Island, Boom Island, Boom Island. We can fix up Boom Island because Boom Island, uh, we need things to go boom. We uh, require explosive cannon shells. We also require uh, radars. And explosives. So we need to make a whole bunch of explosives. Plus we need to uh, automate our explosive cannon shells with the explosives. To also automate radars to make artillery shells. Because everybody wants an artillery boat. But we need to worry about that in the very next episode. So thank you guys for watching. As always, do hope you've enjoyed. I will see you guys in the very next episode. Very next stream. Or I'll see you in two hours for Captain of Street. Anyway, that's it. I'm out. Thank you for watching. As always, do hope you've enjoyed. And yes, I'll see you guys in the very next one. Alright, bye.